masu aikin cetu da bayar da agajin gaggawa a Najeriya sun ce akalla mutane 30 sun riga mu gidan gaskiya yayin wasu munana harhari na kunar bakin wake wanda aka kai a wani gidan kallon kwallo a Arewa maso gabashin kasar shugaba Muhammadu Buhari a ranar Lahadi yayi alhini tare da jajantawa ɗan uwan wanda harin ya rutsa da su a yankin Mandarari a ƙaramar hukumar Konduga ta jihar Burno Hukumar zabi mai zaman kanta a Najeriya wato AINEC ta bayyana cewa ba za ta tsoma bakinta a cece ku canda ke faruwa a kotun zabe tsakanin jam'iyyar PDP da APC ba Shugaban hukumar ta AINEC Professor Mahmud Yakubu ya bayyana cewa AINEC ba za ta yi gaggawar yin magana a zaurin kotu ba a cewar Mr. Rotimi Oyekami duk wani dan jaridan da ya tsoma bakin sa akan batun da ke gaban kotu a yanzu zai iya gurfana a gaban kotun da ke sauraron karar zabe na shekara ta 2019 jigajigan jam'iyyar APC mai mulki a jihar Kogi sun yi kira ga uwar jam'iyya ta kasa baki daya wajen ganin an yi amfani da tsarin kato bayan kato wajen tsaye da dan takarar gwamna a APC a jiya litinin 17 ga wannan wata wasu daga cikin masu fada aji a cikin jam'iyyar ta APC na son jam'iyyar ta yi yar tinki wajen fito da wanda zai rike tutar jam'iyyar a zaben gwamnatin jihar a Gambia a Gambia ranar 17 ga wannan wata shugaban kasar Gambia Adam Abaru yayi jawabin karshe game da yayyuwar shin ko zai ci gaba da rike ragamar kasar ni na tsawon shekaru 5 ko kuma shekaru 3 inda ya gabatar da cewa zai kasance shugaban kasar har zuwa shekara ta 2021 Mr Baru yayi magana a ranar Asabar Abrikama lokacin da yake jawabi ga dubban magoya bayan sa a yayin wani taron siyasa ya ce shirin sa shine tabbatar da dacewa da bunkasa tattalin arzikin kasar ta Gambia A ranar Laraba da ta gabata shugaban kasar Gambia Adam Abaru ya bari kyauta mai girma ya bari kyautar a wajen taron manyan tarorukan kungiyar bankin Raya Nahir Africa a Malabo headquarter Gini Conakry Côte d'Ivoire Komitin samar da makamashi a Afrika ACE a ranar litinin yayi kira ga gwamnatocin Afrika da kamfanonin man fitar da su yi kokari dan tabbatar da tsaro na musamman kan wutar lantarki a Afrika kungiyar makamashin ta Afrika ta nuna damuwar ta da sun bada kariya ga kayayyakin makamashi dan samar da isashiyar wutar lantarki a nahiyar ta Afrika A Kamaru, shugaban kasa Pombia ya gabatar da ranar Juma'a 21 ga watan Yuni a matsayin ranar makoki don girmamawa ga sojojin da aka kashe a yankin Arewa maso gabashin kasar. Wanda yan ta'addan kungiyar Boko Haram suka kai wa farmaki a garuruwan Darak, Logoni da Chari na Arewa maso gabashin kasar inda suka kashe akalla sojoji 16 tare da fararin huluna 8 har yanzu a Cameroon ana bada takardun izinin zama in majalisar wakilai wata majiya ta ce za a iya bada takardun izinin zama in majalisar wakilai a cikin watanni biyu ta hanyar ta hanyar kundin gudanar da tsarin aikin kasar A Kamaru ana bada takardun izinin zama in majalisar wakilai Wata majiya ta ce za a iya bada takardun izinin zama in majalisar wakilai cikin watanni biyu kacal ta hannun kundin tsarin mulkin kasar Bisa ga takardun da aka fitar daga fadar shugaban kasar wanda ta fara yawo tun kafin a fitar da ita a kafofin sadarwa na zamani Shugaban kasa ya gabatar da 
shugaban majalisar dattije da prime minister akan yiyuwar kare yawan wa'adin majalisa na tsawon watanni biyu gwamnatin benin ta yanke shawara kan gina manyan allunan hotuna masu amfani da hasken rana guda hudu tare da karfi mega white hamsin a majalisar ministoci wanda wannan shiri zai iya magance masalar kananan abubuwan da za su iya inganta samun ya waitar kudin shiga a hotar lantarki a fadin kasar a wata sanarwa ya ce wannan yarjejeniya a ƙarshen taron majalisar ministoci aka gabatar da ita da ya gudana a ranar Alhamis sha uku ga watan yuni a shekara ta 2019 a birnin Kwatanu Shugaban kasar Chadi Idris Deby ya jaddada goyon bayan sa ga dukkan kokarin da sojojin kasar Sudan suka yi don cin mai yarjejeniya tsakanin su da yan siyasa masu gudanar da zanga zanga a kasar inda yace zai yi aiki dan tallafawa Sudan da samun kwanciyar hankali a cikin tattaunawar hadin guiwa dake tsakanin sa da shugaban majalisar dakarun soja kasar Sudan Rukunin kungiyar farko ta Abdul Fattah Al-Burhan ta bayyana a Injimaina cewa Sudan da Chadi suna da dangantakar tarihi mai tsawon gaske. Shugaban majalisar dokokin Larabawa Dr. Marshall Al-Salami ya jaddada bukatar aiki ta gaggawa wadda za ta kiyaye ka'idojin kare ikon kasashen Larabawa da gare ki cin kasashen waje. A cikin harkokin Larabawa wanda ya zo ne yayin jawabin da Salami ya gabatar a gaban taron majalisar dokokin Larabawa da aka shirya a hede kwatar kungiyar Larabawa da aka da aka kira don magance matsalolin kasashen Larabawa da makwaftanta Wani sabon zabi ya bayyana Wani sabon zabi ya bayyana cewa kashi 60 cikin dari na Isra'ilawa sun yi imanin cewa tsananin kunciyan arziki a Gaza ne ya haddasa tsatsauran ra'ayi da ta'addanci a kasar. Sun kuma danganta rikicin da rashin tsaro tsakanin Hamas da Isra'ila. Hamas ta ce za ta fara aiwatar da wasu kungiyoyi masu yawa don samar da dan samar da mafita da nisan ta Isra'ila daga Gaza kakakin Hamas Hazim Qasim ya shaidawa mani ma labarai a Gaza cewa mafi yawan hanyoyin samar da fahimtar sun hada da samun goyon bayan iyalan marasa lafiya wutar lantarki ruwan sha aikin wucin gadi akan iyakoki 